or so anything like that, and there's no allergic reactions to us, to my knowledge anyway. I have this little foot pedal, which when I press it, the pistol starts firing. Okay? You can also see that this has like a feather inside. When you have to treat with it, you push it to the line there. Then, then the pistol is pre-tensioned. Okay? So, let me just show you how he did it. Now you can, you can do uh, this to be bulletproof. Uh, so you can do the Teresmina, the infraspinatus, the supraspinatus, the subscapularis, and the biceps. So you can do all of them, basically. Because then you don't have to be very, very clever to figure out which muscle is actually involved precisely. So just do all of them. If you end up, do all of them. And that is, we need something to drive him off. So, so, let me just show you. Usually I start from behind and move forward. And the reason why I do that is that it is less painful in the thick area of the muscle here. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. <laughs> and also to see how much pressure the patient can take. I put the pressure on two bar. This is like half the maximum pressure. And he will most definitely be able to take that with no problem. The further you move anteriorly, the more painful it will become. Because of the density of the soft tissue will decrease. So, one thing that you have to be aware of is that you don't only have to look what you're doing, but you have to look at the patient's face as well. As well. Mm -hmm. Facial expression in treating is everything. The next response after a facial expression is that they kick or hit you. <laughs> and then you're in a dangerous business. <laughs> so now I treat right under the acromion. You see that? Spinal scapula following acromion around here. And remember that the pistol is in the anatomical direction of the humerus and the muscle. So I don't do like this, I do like this, yeah? So when I move around, <coughs> I do everything now, don't I? It's because I, I'm uncertain that I found the right diagnosis. And in here, he will be more sore. It's more painful in here, isn't it? Yeah. In this area, it will be more painful. Over the biceps of group and the biceps tendon, it is more painful. Now, if I want to start to uh, treat the supraspinatus, I will treat this area particularly. And that is also painful. And I can actually feel that the muscle is rolling under and he can feel it. So now I will explain to the patient Right now, I'm over the muscle of involvement because he has an impingement. Now, try and look how I hold the pistol. I control it with my hand. Yeah? 
So I have it close to the patient. If I do it like this, yeah, this is not good. And also, it's painful for the patient. If you slide <laughs> off like this, it is really painful. So you don't want to do that, and it's not controllable. It is not